Well, who will be the first in line to get a COVID-19 vaccine? With the first vaccine potentially available as early as next week, a CDC advisory panel met this afternoon to debate that very important issue. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge has been listening to the panel of experts, and I hear they have yet to take a vote, Frank. Yeah, that's exactly right. But, you know, in part of their discussion, as expected, healthcare workers will be the first to receive vaccine. But another important group are really long term care facility residents and workers. Now, from the standpoint of maximizing benefits, healthcare workers, of course, are important because it is possible for us to transmit an infection to vulnerable people. There's also a multiplier value in preventing us from becoming infected. Also, it's essential that we preserve healthcare capacity and prevent healthcare workers from falling ill. But as far as long-term care facility residents, there are roughly 3 million in the U.S. And vaccinating them in the first group maximizes benefits because, frankly, they are at the highest risk for infection, severe disease, and death. Also, protecting them has the benefits of decreasing hospital use. Terribly important. Now, the early reports, uh, Doc, suggest that the vaccine is well tolerated, but I understand they also brought up issues about the reaction people might have to being vaccinated. Yeah, so the data from the phase one and two trials with both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccine actually show that especially with the second dose, there is a reasonably high rate of fever, headache and muscle aches, enough so that they actually talked about not vaccinating, let's say, an entire ER at the same time so that everyone isn't experiencing mm -hmm. side effects yeah. simultaneously. Yeah. yeah, yeah, obviously people have a lot of questions about these vaccines, but you say that's that's a good thing that people have questions. Oh, absolutely. You know, I really want everyone to ask their questions and find out the answers. Yeah. Do the homework that you need to do to feel confident about these vaccines. And in fact, tomorrow at 6.30 a.m., I'll be taking a closer look at the key questions that everyone needs to be asking yeah. before you roll up your sleeve. Exactly. All right, Doc, we'll see you then.